Não. Ó, só tem eu aqui. Pensa na pizza. Finge que não tem ninguém lá. Eu vou fechar o olho. Oi, tem. Hello, everybody, and welcome to our virtual science fair. I am teacher Clarissa, and today we're going to show you a little bit of everything we learned this year. Falamos sobre os animals e aprendemos sobre as suas características. Aprendemos também sobre as causas e as consequências da extinção de animals and plants. Entendemos a importância do sol para a nossa vida na Terra e aprendemos a analisar o weather. E também falamos sobre non-living things, falamos sobre as rocks. E vimos o processo de formação das pedras. Now it's time for our mini scientists to show their work. Very good. We're going to start talking about sharks. Let's begin. Sharks are huge animals. Gray white sharks can be seven inches long and weigh 2,000 kilograms. They can have 3,000 teeth. If sharks are so big and heavy, how can they float in the ocean? Let's find out. Sharks have a cartilaginous skeleton and cartilaginous wings last bites. Sharks have livers filled with oil. Oil is less dense than water, so it's helped them float. Let's observe this balloon. This one is like a shark. It's filled with oil. This one has water inside. Very good. Let's see what's happening to the balloons when we put them in the water. This one floats because it has oil. This one sinks because it has water. Very good, guys. So what did we learn about sharks? O que, que a gente aprendeu sobre os sharks? Como é que é inside, dentro dos sharks? They have? Oil. oil. E por que, que ele vai float, flutuar? Because the oil is less dense. dense. Yeah. Very good. O óleo é menos denso, right? So the shark floats, even though it's very big and very heavy, right? Yeah. Okay, very good. Now, thank you for watching. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank you. Okay, now let me organize my lab. And now it's time for Zach Fish. Okay. Lembrando que a live vai ficar salva no YouTube, ok? Então vocês podem assistir de novo depois. Ok, let's go. It's time for Zach the fish. Very good. There you go, Zach. The factory, the sign. Ok? There you go. So, let's tell the story of Zach the fish. Something bad happened to Zach, right, guys? Okay, so let's see what happened. Hello, everybody. This is Zach the fish. It lives in a beautiful river. He likes to swim. This is his habitat. It's clean and fresh. Zach drinks water from this river. But now things are changing. There is a factory near the river. Just a second. Let me get his habitat and put here. The factory is polluting the water. Look, it's dirty. What will happen to Zach? So the factory is polluting the water, right? 
Okay. João Vicente, what will happen to Zach? Zach said because he's drunk. Polluted the water. If polluted continues, Zach and his family may be endangered. Okay, come here, João. Come here with me. Come here. Let's show people at home what happened to Zach. Show Zach. What happened to Zach? Zach? Sick. Zach is sick. Because he drank? Because he drank polluted water. If polluted continues, Zach and his, sick. Zach and his family may be endangered. Very good. Come, let's go back. Thank you. Yeah. Pollution is bad. We should protect the animals. Very good. So, guys, stop pollution. Pollution is bad. 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 Very good. So, we should protect the animals. What do we say now? Bye bye. bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Subscribe. Subscribe us, please. And leave a comment. Leave a comment. Very good. Subscribe the channel. Thank you. Bye bye, boys. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you, João. Let me get Zach here. Let me organize things here. Let me organize my lab. Okay. Here and here. Come here. Stay here, baby. Stay here. Thank you. Yes, you can leave it here if you want. We are live. You're now YouTubers, very famous. So now it's time for our Cecia News. -na 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 -na. Oops. Now it's time for the weather forecast. Laura, what's the weather like in Rio? Hi, Leticia. It's sunny and hot. Put on your sunglasses and your hat. Julia, what about Londo? What's the weather like? It's raining. Take your umbrella and put on your raincoats back to you, Luca. Luca, tell me what's the weather like in Glasgow. Hi, Luca. Here in Glasgow, it's cold and snowy. Put on your boots and gloves. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Guys, what do we say now? Bye bye. bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Subscribe no canal. Subscribe. Very good. Thank you, guys. Very good. Bye bye. Well done. Okay. Now let's talk about polar bears. We're going to learn a little bit about polar bears. Come here, polar bears. Here you have your material. Okay, so. Polar bear is a living thing, right? Because it's an animal. So we're going to learn a little bit more about polar bears. Okay? Polar, bear. polar bears live in freezing places and they don't wear winter clothes. How do they get protected from the cold? Okay, so let's learn. Hello, I'm Joaquin, the scientist. Let's I know that happens to polar bears. For the experiment, we need gloves and ice cube. Stay here. Não precisa sair não, pessoal. Fica aqui, pode ficar aqui. Fica aqui, no problem. First, get the ice cube. Can you feel how cold it is? That's because we don't have any protecting on. 
Lele, tell me, is it hot or cold? In your cold. hand. Cold. Very cold, right? Stay here, stay here. Stay here, guys. Stay here, come here. Don't worry. Let's move this part. Now, now let's put on gloves. Put the glove. Okay. Test the ice cube. Can you feel it? No. That's because we have a thick glove to protect us. Okay, Salami, so tell me, is it hot or cold? Co hot. Ah, oh, very good. So now it's hot, right? With the lay. Stay here, stay here. With the lay, it was cold because you didn't have any gloves. And with you, it's hot, right? Because you have gloves. Okay, just a second. So our friend Lara is not here. So, guys, don't worry. Our friend Lara is not here, so I'm going to say her part, okay? So that's what happens to polar bears. They have a thick white fur, like our glove, to keep them warm in cold places. Did you know, okay. Did you know that polar bears can camouflage in the snow? Their white fur can protect from the predators. Bye-bye. Yeah. Leo, tell me, what color is the snow? White. And what color is the polar bear? White. So what happens to the polar bear? Can the predator see the polar bears? No, but because this is because there are camouflage. Very good, guys. Well done. So what do we say now? Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Subscribe in the channel. Subscribe in the channel. Very good. Thank you. Bye-bye, guys. Thank you very much. Okay, so it's time for Zach the Fish once again. Pessoal de casa, só para lembrá-los mais uma vez que a live vai ficar salva, ok? Vocês podem assistir de novo depois. Let's go. Wow, look. Let's go. Here you have your sack. Excuse me. The factory. Stay in position. I don't think I'm so lugar. No problem, okay? So, guys, something bad happened to Zach, right? So now we're going to tell the story of Zach, okay? Hello everybody, this is a the fish. He's in a beautiful river. He's like the swim. This is his This is his habitat. It is clean and fresh. Zach drinks the water from the river. But now things are changing. There is a factory near the river. Just a second, teacher, vai puxar. Levanta sua pele. Thank you. Peraí, deixa eu botar o microfone. The factory is polluting the water. Look. It, it's dirty. What will happen to Zach? Okay, so we have pollution now, Lucas. What will happen to Zach? Peraí. Wait. There you go. Zach is sick because he drank polluted water. Polluted continues. Zach and family may be in danger of extinction. Okay, come here. Get Zach, Lucas. Pega o Zach. Come here. Come here. Let's show. Get Zach. Traz o Zach. Bring Zach. Let's show people at home what happened to Zach. Show them at the camera. So what happened to Zach? Zach is... Zack is sick because he drank polluted water. Very polluted good. continuing Zack and family may be in danger. Very good. Very good. So Zack is sick, right? Because of pollution. Look at the river. How is the river, guys? Clean or dirty? Dirty. Very good. Okay. So Zanoff, you tell me. 
<laughs> Pollution is bad. We should protect the environment. Help us save the animal. Very good. So, guys, pollution is bad. bad. Very good. We should protect the animals, right? Bye. Save the animals. Bye bye. Bye bye. Subscribe. Subscribe the channel, Lucas. Say it again. Subscribe. Very good, guys. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you very much. So now it's time for the rocks. Now we're changing the subject. Agora a gente vai falar de non-living things. Deixa a teacher tirar o Zach, right? Porque Zach é living thing. E agora a gente vai falar de non-living thing, right? Yes, bye bye, Zach. Okay, so let's begin. Okay. Rocks and mountains in so heaven, properties and soot and colors and textures. Come here. Come here, let's show people at home your rock. Show them your rock. Mostra para eles a sua rock. Okay. My rock is um, colorful and rough. Very good. Come here. Okay, no problem. Okay, we'll go up. Eden's rocks are made of cool lava from Brooklyn. Okay, come here. We have a scientist with a broken arm. Show them your rock. Come here. I love rock. Very good. Okay, so now what can you tell me about your rock, Lulu? My rock is pink and rough. Very good. Pink and rough. No problem. Sedimentary rocks are made of plants and animals. Come here. Let's show them your rock. Show them your rock, Lulu. My rock is triangle. Very good. Metamorphic rocks need pressure and teeth to be formed. Come, let's show your rock. Show them your rock. My rock is strong and smooth. Very good, strong and smooth, very good. What about you, Mateus? What can you tell me about rocks? Rocks are also made of minerals such as mica and quartz. Do you have a rock? Okay, so let's show the people at home. Show them your rock. My rock, my rock is purple and rough. Very good, purple and rough. Very good. Guys, rocks are living things or non-living things? Non-living things. Do they have a life cycle? No. Do they grow and change? No. No, very good. Thank you very much, guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you for watching. Very good, very good, girls. Well done, well done. Pessoal de casa, obrigada por assistirem. Lembrando mais uma vez que a live fica salva. Vocês podem assistir de novo depois. Ok? Thank you. Bye, bye.